I'll show you guys uh, some of the potted plants we still have out in our garden in November uh, here on Salt Spring Island. So uh, the first one we have here is a Yucca Gigantea right there and not a good practice to keep these out all winter if it gets too cold because if the pots freeze then your plant is going to be toast so i watch the weather remember if you keep have potted plants outside and they're marginal watch the weather forecast if it's going to get too cold you might want to move them into a sheltered location or in a, to an area where the pot's not going to freeze here's another yucca gigantea these ones i've grown from cuttings here is a uh, kensha palm this one got fried up in the heat in uh, June, unfortunately, this is the worst it's ever looked, but uh, we'll be bringing this one in when it starts to get colder out. It hasn't been cold. Uh, here's a pumelo citrus in a pot. There's a Trachycarpus latissectus in a pot. That one I had in the ground for a long time. I took it out because it was stressed. It's actually doing better now. It's recovering. Trachycarpus martianus in a pot. That's got to go in. Bird of paradise in a pot. That's got to go in. We have orchids out here. These are hardy. They can stay out in pots, the boxwood and that roto. Uh, orchids we have outside. These stay out year round. They got fried in the heat, the sago palms. Uh, there's an oleander in a pot. I'll keep that out as long as possible. We do grow them in the ground. Um, let's just see what we have on the lower sun deck. Oh, there's a kumquat. That actually stays out most of the year. I'll put it in if it gets too cold because we don't want the pot to freeze. There's another Phoenix canariensis, a date palm. And because uh, like I say, uh, folks, palms and plants in pots are less cold hardy, right? Uh, there is a Trachycarpus latissectus in a pot. That's a 15 gallon pot. These stay out year round, this one with the phygelia in here and the uh, palm tree. That's gonna go in if it gets too cold, Camerops humulus in a pot. There's a Meyer lemon in a pot with lemons coming on it. You can see the lemons forming. Uh, date palms got to go in to the tiki hut. Gets too cold. And then we have another orchid, Cymbidium. There's a lime. Uh, I'm trying to think what else we have here. Oh, we have more date palms. Those got to go in when it gets too cold. And another Rapidophyllum hystrix. So those are our potted plants outside here on the lower sun deck. We have a few more up on top. But uh, these guys are going to need some help when it gets too cold. So remember, folks, uh, keep in mind, Plants and pots are less cold tolerant. So watch the forecast at this time of the year. Like I say, we're in November at this latitude and uh, things can change pretty quick. So you don't want those pots to freeze. Just have a, make sure you have an area to put those uh, planters in a garage that doesn't freeze. Uh, we have a tiki hut and uh, it's actually dry in there and everything seems to do very well. And we also have a rock basement we can throw some stuff into. All right, guys, thanks for watching. And uh, just keep on top of the weather at this time of the year if you're in a northern latitude. Don't want those exotics to freeze. Cheers.